when it comes to computer forensics, due to the ever-changing and diverse nature of digital investigations, it's more important than ever that we get as much detail as possible about all the exhibits prior to a full instruction. In order to streamline your request and make it as efficient as possible, ideally we need the following information. What type of machine it is, whether it's a laptop or a desktop, whether we need to image that device on-site or off-site, whether we can do it in our lab, the operating system of that machine, so is it a Windows machine, a Linux box or a Mac, and then we talk about the hard drive. What size is that hard drive? What type of hard drive? Is it an SSD or a mechanical drive? And ideally, how much data is stored on it? As much of that information as possible can really assist when we are trying to streamline that process. And if we're being instructed from a defence perspective on a prosecution case, there is also other relevant information from the prosecution examination that we require. This includes, but isn't limited to, file paths of the relevant data that's been found, any contemporaneous notes from the examiner, any photographs that have been taken of any of the exhibits, and any other relevant information such as encryption and passwords that the examiner has used during their process. Additionally, when it comes to computer forensics, as with every other investigation that CIFOR are instructed on, you can always pick up the phone, speak to an expert, get some advice and be pointed in the right direction.